Hi Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea and in this reading we are going to find out how does your person feel about you right now. To book a personal reading with me, all information is in the description box below. And today is the 10th of April 2023. Time here in Genoa, Italy is 10.10pm, 10, 10 1010. Check out your angel number, you can go ahead and google it. And such, um, the setting looks different because I'm in a different Airbnb. I just came back from Milan, back to Genoa. I was in Genoa, then Milan, then back to Genoa. Anyway, let's get our reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me how does Sagittarius person feel about them right now. Please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and the person. Page of Swords and Reverse at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so your person has been spying on you, keeping tabs on you, and they miss you. Six of Cups. Three of Swords, they're very sad. Five of Pentacles, they feel like this connection is either very challenging or both of you could be separated, okay? Some of you, it's just, you know, Three of Swords, Ace of Swords, something you may have said to them that really made them sad or they may have said something to you that may have made you feel really sad but for a lot of you Sag, this could be somebody you could be separated from okay if not again the ace of swords like somebody has said something and it was really hurtful right right next to three of wands and with the ten of wands if it's your person who has said something very hurtful to you then I sense them feeling sorry about it, okay, with the Six of Cups. Unless if roles are being rubbed first, they could be feeling really sad and that they feel like you should be the one apologizing to them, okay? They could be waiting for your apology with the Page of Swords and Rovers again, it could go vice versa. But whatever the case is with the Knight of Cups here, your person does care about you, they do love you. Um, could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, could also be a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, again, strong Cancer, can be any sign. I sense them feeling as though you are not reciprocating, okay? Because the Queen of Pentacles is in a first, so that means if this is you, unless it's being reversed, so someone here isn't really um investing fully okay maybe sag it's you cutting them off and you're no longer investing in the chair in reverse you just pull the bricks and you and because of that with the three swords they could be feeling really sad feeling left out in the cold with the five pentacles or just missing you if you look at these five pentacles right now there are two people right and the Six of Cups, there are two people here too. They could be feeling sad because both of you, Six of Cups can sometimes indicate some something from the past, right? So your person will be feeling as though, you know, maybe both of you were happy, right? kind to each other, very understanding. But now with the Five Pentacles right next to Queen of they feel like you have changed, yeah? They feel like you have changed. Something about them feeling as though now maybe you've come to a realization that things are not the same anymore. It's not like how, you know, Six of Cups, like, and look at the Wheel of Fortune here as well. So something about, either, again, it could go vice versa, but your person feels like you have changed and that you're no longer the same person. 
the six of cups you used to be very receptive to them very understanding almost so innocent right but now you have become a different person where because ace ace can indicate new beginning so something new about you that they feel that they feel with the five of pentacles here as so though now you know they are they are the ones that have to keep up with you because you see six of cups these two people actually they're kids but they're looking at each other but the five pentacles yeah this person is no longer looking at this person this person is like walking away and this person is trying to catch up with him or her again it doesn't matter it's not gender specific so your person could be feeling like they need to catch up with you catch up with the changes that you have made to yourself to your life or something that has changed yeah and it's making them feel really sad with the three of swords here yeah. now they feel alone because ten of wands now they are like they feel like you're not doing it with them or that you are at a different level now and just different person yeah well of fortune again it indicates change but but they do, I feel, I sense them missing how things used to be for the both of you. How things used to be, but these changes, they feel, they're not happy about it. But some of them may not even really show it, right? They don't really want you to know. Unless you already know, then I feel like your person is just so sad that things have changed. Like you're definitely not the same person. Now they have to try to keep up with you or that now they have to chase after you. Like they are the ones who cares about you, they feel, but you don't. And it breaks their heart, right? See, the Knight of Cups still carry, holding, holding a cup here, right? And the Six of Cups. Look, it's the same person. It's just that it's grown up, right? This is younger. This is already older. And you used to be receptive, right? Looking at him or her. Accepting this bouquet of flowers. But now you are looking away from them. See, even this queen is looking towards this way. Like, they feel like you're not... They're not your focus anymore they are not your focus anymore you're not mm, i mean they're not your priority anymore they feel that way mm. they're sensing as though things have changed but feels like these changes is super hard for them to deal with because it's a big change right again will of fortune is major kana it's a big change they don't know if it could go back to how things used to be mm -hmm. let's see a little bit more yeah, see, Six of Pentacles and Lovers. I feel like you don't give them anymore. You don't invest anymore. Six of Swords and Lovers. They're still stuck wondering if things could go back to how it used to be. Go back to normal. Death and Lovers. If they could revive this connection to how it used to be. Alright, Sash, this is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you like to book me, my information is in the description box below. And I'm so sorry that I'm kind of whispering right now because it's a bit late. Um, yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe if you resonated with this reading in some way, shape, or form. And I'm open for personal readings. If you like to book me, my information is in the description box below. And feel free to subscribe to my channels. I have three channels now. Chelsea Love Tarot, 
Chelsea Tarot 2.0 and Chelsea Vlogs, which is my um, travel channel. I just posted a few shorts recently, I think one, two, three, four shorts. So yeah, check them out if you want to. And also don't forget to hit on the bell notification button if you like to be notified every time, every time when I post your videos. Alright, take care, Satch. Hope to see you back here again later or tomorrow. Bye.